Good Era Squad. Thank y'all so much for tuning back in with your girl. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also hit that post bell notification so you do not miss any time I post a new video. So y'all, y'all, y'all. We back again with the Drake and Kendrick diss. Um, beef, I said diss. Beef, um, meet the grams. We're going to go ahead and get right into it. It's six minutes and 32 seconds of, I'm sure, craziness. Let's get right into it. I ain't going to waste no time. Dear Adonis, I'm sorry that that man is your father. Let me be honest. It takes a man to be a man. Your dad is not responsive. Yo, not the Dear Adonis. Not a letter like you write it to his son. Let, let me just go ahead and... That's beyond. <laughs> I'll tell you, oh, nothing out, nothing be off the table during the diss. Don't, nothing. The kids, the, the baby mamas, the baby dad, all of them get it, okay? Let's just go ahead and go back. I wasn't ready, all right? Wow. Not dear Adonis. And it's your father, let me be. Gotta go back. Dear Adonis, I'm sorry that that man is your father, let me be honest. It takes a man to be a man, your dad is not responsive. I look at him and wish your grandpa would have wore a condom. I'm sorry that you gotta grow up and then stand behind him. Life is hard, I know. The challenges always go beat us home. Sometimes our parents make mistakes that affect us until we grown. And you're a good kid that need good leadership. Let me be your mentor, since your daddy don't teach you shit. Never let a man piss on your legs, son. Either you die right there or pop that man in the head, son. Never fall in the escort business, that's bad religion. Please remember, you could be a bitch even if you got bitches. Never code switch, whether right or wrong. You're a black man even if it don't okay, let me pause 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 because 49 seconds in and kendrick stepped on his neck and broke it okay so he goes on to write he's writing a letter as it's, he's writing to his son adonis right he then goes and say he's sorry he's your dad because obviously we you know drake had questionable parental ish you know concerns um before we learned about his son um wow he then goes to say that he wished he looked at him and wished that his dad would have wore a condom like Drake's dad. Um, so so that Drake was never born. Um, wow. And then he goes on and says, let me be your mentor since your daddy is not a good leader. Like, come on. Ooh, that's so many shots in 49 seconds. Let me let me. Yeah, it's just. Ooh. Wow on your legs son either you die right there or pop that man in the head son never fall in the escort business that's bad religion please remember you could be a bitch even if you got bitches never code switch whether right or wrong you're a black man even if it don't benefit your goals do some push-ups get some discipline don't cut them corners like your daddy did fuck what ozempic did don't pay to play with them brazilians get a gym membership understand no throwing rocks and hiding hands that's law don't be ashamed about who you with, that's how he treats your moms. Don't have a kid to hide a kid to hide again, be sure. 5% will comprehend, but 95 is lost. Be proud of who you are. You Don't have a kid to hide a kid, and then again. What the heck? <laughs> it's like every disc gets crazier and crazier, like multi-layer disses, like... With nothing off the table. It's getting bizarre at this point. <laughs> Membership. Understand. No throwing rocks and hiding hands. That's law. Don't be ashamed about who you with. That's how he treats your moms. Don't have a kid to hide a kid to hide again. Be sure. 5% will comprehend, but 95 is lost. Be proud of who you are. Your strength come from within. A lot of superstars, that's real. But your daddy ain't one of them. And you nothing like him. You'll carry yourself as king. Can't understand me right now. Just play this when you're 18. Okay. You know what? I like that he used this minute and 25 seconds to tell Adonis, although your dad is not, you know, is a piece of, you know, y'all can fill in the blanks. Um, he kind of built him up in a way. Even though it was a diss, he didn't say anything bad about the kid which i appreciate because leave the kids out of it but if you're gonna put the kid in it build him up and then he said you ain't gonna rem you're not gonna understand right now play this when you're 18 boy look at here and he only is five or six boy look at here mm -mm -mm. 
people, but your daddy ain't one of them, and you nothing like him, you'll carry yourself as king, can't understand me right now, just play this when you 18. Dear Sandra, your son got some habits, I hope you don't undermine them Especially with all the girls that's hurt inside this climate You a woman, so you know how it feels to be in alignment With emotions, hoping a man can see you and not be blinded Dear Dennis, you gave birth to a master manipulator Even using you to prove who he is is a huge favor I think you should ask for more paper, and more paper, and more, uh, more paper I'm blaming you for all his gambling addictions, psychopath intuition, the man that like to play victim. You raised a horrible fucking person, the nerve of you, Dennis. Sandra, sit down, what I'm about to say is heavy, now listen. <clears throat> Your son's a sick man with sick thoughts, I think niggas like him should die. Him and Weinstein should get fucked up in a cell for the rest, they laugh. He hates black women, hypersexualize him with kinks of an info fetish. Grew facial hair because he understood being the beard just fit him better. He got sex offenders on Hovio that he keep on a monthly allowance. And a child should never be compromised and he keeping his child around him. And we gotta raise our daughters knowing there's predators like him lurking. Fuck a rap battle, he should die so all of these women can live with a purpose. I bet it's the voice. It's given very much so eerie and mysterious. But it's the fact that he told us that Drake should die about two times, okay? Three times, really, because he ain't, he's mad that his father did not wear a condom, so he now exists. <laughs> wow. Wow. Kendrick. A child should never be compromised. Yo, no, no, no. Die. Him and Weinstein should... Psychopath intuition, the man that like to play victim You raised a horrible fucking person, the nerve of you, Dennis Sandra, sit down, what I'm about to say is heavy, now listen <clears throat> Your son's a sick man with sick thoughts, I think niggas like him should die Him and Weinstein should get fucked up in a cell for the rest, they laugh He hates black women, hypersexualize him with kinks of an info fetish Grew facial hair because he understood being the beard just fit him better He got sex offenders on Hovio that he keep on a monthly allowance And a child should never be compromised and he keeping his child around him and we gotta raise our daughters knowing there's predators like him lurking Fuck a rap battle, he should die so all of these women can live with a purpose I've been in this industry 12 years, I'ma tell y'all one little secret There's some weird shit going on and some of these artists be here to police it They be streamlining victims all inside of their home and calling them tender Then leak videos, sell themselves to further push their agendas To any woman that be playing this music, know that you're playing your sister Or better yet, selling your niece to the weirdos, not the good ones Cat Williams, I gave you the truth, so I'ma get mine The embassy about to get raided too it's only a matter of time. Hey, Lil Bron, keep the family away. Hey, Curry, keep the family away. To anybody that embody the love for their kids, keep the family away. They looking at you too if you standing by him. Keep the family away. I'm looking to shoot through any pervert that lives. Keep the family safe. Dear baby girl, I'm sorry that your father not active inside your world. He don't commit to much but his music, yeah, that's for sure. He a narcissist, misogynist, living inside his songs. Try to destroy families rather than taking care of his own. Should be teaching you timetables or watching Frozen with you. Or at your 11th birthday, singing poems with you. Instead, he being Turks, paying for sex and popping perks. Examples that you don't deserve. I want to tell you that you're loved. You're brave. You're kind. You got a gift to change the world and can change your father's mind. Because our children is the future, but he lives inside confusion. Money's always been illusion, but that's the life he's used to His father probably didn't claim him neither History do repeats itself, sometimes it don't need a reason But I would like to say it's not your fault that he's hiding another child Give him grace, this the reason I made Mr. Morale So our babies like you can cope later Give you some confidence to go through something, it's hope later I never wanna hear you chasing man cause it's felt behavior Sitting in the club with sugar daddies for validation You need to know that love is eternity and trumps all pain i tell you who your father is just play this song when it rains yes he's a hit maker songwriter superstar right and a fucking dead beat that should never say more life meet the grams <laughs> dear hybrid i know you probably thinking i wanted to crash your party 
But truthfully, I don't have a hating bone in my body It's supposed to be a good exhibition within the game But you fucked up the moment you called out my family's name Why you had to stoop so low to discredit some decent people Guess integrity is lost when the metaphors doesn't reach you And I like to understand cause your house was never a home 37 but you showing up as a 7 year old You got gambling problems, drinking problems, pill popping and spending problems Bad with money, horror house, soliciting women problems Therapy's a lovely start, but I suggest some ayahuasca Strip the ego from the bottom I try to empathize with you Cause I know that you ain't been through nothing Crave entitlement But wanna be like so bad that it's puzzling No dominance Let's recap moments when you didn't fit in No secret handshakes with your friend No culture cachet to binge Just disrespecting your mother Identities on the fence Don't know which family would love you The skin that you living in Is compromised and personas Can't channel your masculine Even when standing next to a woman You a body shamer You go hide them baby mamas ain't you You embarrassed of them That's not right That ain't how mama raised us take that mask off i want to see what's under them achievements why well, believe you you never gave us nothing to believe in because you lied about religious views you lied about your surgery you lied about your accent and your past tense all is perjury you lied about your ghost riders you lied about your crew members they all pussy you lied on them i know they all got you in them you lied about your son you lied about your daughter huh you lied about them other kids that's out there hoping that you come you lied about the only artist that can offer you some help Fuck a rap battle, this a long life battle with yourself. Wow. Whew. Six minutes and 32 seconds, huh? Straight bars. I'm telling you, it's getting crazier and crazier. Let me go ahead and look up. Look, listen, let's go ahead and... um. Yeah, because, uh-uh, we can't let some stuff go. Uh-uh, And I know I missed a whole lot. I tell you, all this is highlighted because every word that came out of Kendrick's mouth was a diss. Um, okay, let's go back. Dear Adonis, yes, that's, you know, he wrote, that was, you know, that was self-explanatory. Let me go down because it was some, Sandra got his mama in there too, like, <clears throat> Oh, dang. Sandy Graham, Drake's mother, calls her Sandra on Sandra's row. <laughs> Listen. Wow. Oh, gosh. Oh, let me go all the way down. It was the, he grew, he grew facial hair because he understood being a beard just fit him better. <laughs> a beard is a person who's used to hide being gay. I'm done, Okay. The beard is someone of the opposite sex who enters a usually loveless relationship to hide another person's homosexuality. That is crazy. It can also be for cheating. If you have someone in a relationship cheating on someone who's allegedly single, a beard can enter that relationship to make it seem like they're, they've got a partner and draw suspicion away. That's crazy. Now he got sex offenders. He got. What was the record label that Drake founded? Musicians signed with the label include, but are not limited to party next door all right let's skip all the way okay colonel Rod, who's been charged with prostitution and human trafficking in the past that's crazy let's go down because it was something okay let's see all right so this is the part that got me because i'm like thinking he got another kid like we just learned about adonis Look, I'm out of the loop when it comes to all this beef sometimes, so bear with me. It says, Kendra implies that Drake is hiding an abandoned daughter. This is heavily reminiscent of how Pusha T exposed Drake for hiding his son, Adonis Graham, in his May 2018 diss track, The Story of Adidon. Um, Let's see. Lamar implies that she's been abandoned by him for over 11 years, hence why he never took on the paternity responsibilities of helping her with math, homework, or spending quality time with her by watching Disney films like Frozen. Instead, he was busy living inside songs or obsessing over his music career. Kendrick condemned this obsession with rapping over parenting on April 200. I said 200. April 2024, G4. Okay, so I get that now. That came full circle, okay? That's crazy, okay? So where is the daughter at? And who is who did he have this daughter with? If, listen, if I'm the baby mama and I've been, and I know that Drake is my baby father or whatever, I'm coming out, okay? Coming out. 11 years is crazy. Oh, all right now, Aubrey. 
Oh my gosh. We're gonna go ahead and stop there. That's 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 a bit much, man. That's a lot. These rappers be knowing stuff we have no clue about. And when they come out on the disc, everybody might be on the floor. Like, dang. Anyways, Air Squad, if y'all like my video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also, listen, bring your mama, your daddy, sister, your brother, your grandma, and your grandpa to the AR Squad because we live over here. Anyways, AR Squad, stay beautiful, stay sweet, and keep your business out the streets. Bye, y'all.